these are just some rough sketches of the ideas and the logo name that I was thinking of ended up coming with zero point carpet cleaning it was just some rough sketches something fast quick then I got into the program Inkscape uh, it helps as far as if I needed a logo printed at any size it's scalable so I entered this program and just played around just made something real fast so it's sloppy very much but if the venture happens I'll clean it up even though I'll just clean it up more just because I like messing around with Inkscape so <clears throat> this is just something quick and simple I printed out about 15 letters and sent them out to different people that I would think needed a service. So this is the test subject um, and this is what I'll be working on first gig. So this is the first gig. Yeah, it's, it's a little yucky. But they said it's a creation station, so. But anyway, this is uh, me just prepping the area. Just making sure I can get a good view of my work area. Some sweep action. I definitely want to try sweeping and then vacuuming. But everything right here is um, is just testing things out. So this is the carpet cleaning. I just use that carpet cleaning for uh, my car, but that's all I have. So we're gonna use that. So just filling it up with hot water. Um, I know I need a steamer, so I'll eventually just get into that. But right now we're just prepping. This is a pre-spray. Just kind of, you know, getting something on the carpet. Now, right here I'm thinking I should have vacuumed before I put the pre-spray just to get up any more loose debris. But... Mm, practice makes perfect I guess now I'm vacuuming this is where I said put the pre-spray after I vacuum I can already see that I'm, I'm tracking dirt from the vacuum this is not an industry standard vacuum it's just a regular household vacuum <clears throat> so I can just tell I'm pushing the dirt uh, so next time before I put the pre-spray I'll definitely vacuum and this was more of a spot area I feel like I'm just pushing the dirt around more than you know collecting it. so I just get around the edges with the shop vac there was some paint on the rug uh, some other things but we'll use this and see how it so this is the area rug where I wanted to scrub first just to loosen up anything that was in there so I get a little a hey, and just going at it scrubbing scrubbing dipping hot water if I had a steamer I feel like everything would have just came up a little more, but we only have household items. So we're going to make it do what it do with the first gig. A little more scrubbing action. A little more scrubbing action. It was actually pretty fun scrubbing, but... So I'm just scrubbing that area and it's, I can see it coming up, but 
also I'm just seeing that I'm, I'm kind of just pushing dirt around but I want to hit the whole carpet you know it's my first gig so I'm hitting everything scrubbing it down focus So yeah, we just scrubbing just everything. I only had this bristle brush from like the Dollar Tree or something. So that's all we had. And we just scrubbing. That area where it was really soiled. I was getting at this up there. It really didn't really need anything. I felt like I had pushed some dirt up there. But <clears throat> I kept at it. And I think I did use that whole bottle of carpet cleaner. The air, the air, the whole rug was, it was a little damp. I wouldn't say soaking wet. The vacuum got a lot of it up. This water felt like sand. It was, it was real gritty. But we got it out of there. Just getting a fresh batch of hot water here. Man, I love that water sound. So this is where I was actually calling myself spot cleaning. <clears throat> so I just wanted to get spots that I could see uh, that I can just scrub a little more visually up close so this was me spot cleaning now I gotta learn chemistry a little more as far as fabrics and different rugs and what they need but like I said it was my first gig so it's pretty fun now this is me just, just scrubbing the whole rug. From this angle, yeah. From this angle, it's nice. Scrubbing, scrubbing, scrubbing. So like I said, this is me just scrubbing the whole rug. getting every I was drawn trying to draw the water out of the rug or the dirt out of the rug everything was scrubbed down so I just hit it with the shot vac it actually was pulling up dirt minorly but I could see progress like I said if I had equipment it would work but once again this is not what that's about this is about cleaning a carpet with household items. And it's my first gig, so it's like scratch paper. Except it was dirty, so I had to try to use my eraser. Now I can as you can see I can kinda I was kinda pulling the dirt out the rug. If I would have just hit this area and scrubbed a lot more. The vacuum picked a lot of it up, but I just felt like I was pushing the dirt. That's what I got done. It's a little damp, but came out. That's the household items that were used. And let's talk about it. So this is what the before picture. And this is what the final product looked like not product but carpet but anyway I feel like I said if I just spot just clean that heavily soiled spot and worked around that instead of just hitting the whole carpet 
it would have came out better, but <laughs> three out of ten, man. Three out of ten. Three for effort. Two for execution. <laughs> Experience was cool, though. <laughs>